getting all hooked up here. All right, uh, this video, quick one. These are my top five full striped bass surf fishing lures. So we're gonna start with number five and work our way up to number one. But these are my top five uh, surf fishing lures for the fall, the striped bass, northeast style. Now number five on the list, and keep in mind it does change, and number five is the most interesting one, uh, the little neck popper. I like to throw the little neck popper because they cast great in the wind, and most days you're fishing in a, a crazy, crazy, crazy wind. So I prefer the little neck popper. I put it at number five because it can be number one sometimes. Uh, sometimes those fish key up on top and you're using this half the season. But uh, I'm going to put the little neck popper as my number five full striped bass surf fishing lure. At number five, little neck popper. Lots of stuff out there. Everything works. Um, bass this time of year will just about hit anything you put in front of them. But these are my favorite top five full striped bass surf fishing lures. Okay, number four. A number four favorite full surf striped bass fishing lure is the diamond jig, the diamond jig, tube tail diamond jigs. Um, green, red, yellow, all gray colors. Um, I don't, it, some night, some days it does matter what color they key in, but at number four, I'm gonna have to put the A17 diamond jig. Uh, sometimes the 27s or even 37s in a stiff wind uh, will work wonders, but at number four, I'm gonna have to put the diamond jig cast them into a stiff wind and remember you're casting a wind all the time why number four because I don't work them at night so I'm going to throw the diamond jig as my number four full surf striped bass fishing lure lots of stuff out there everything works um, bass this time of year will just about hit anything you put in front of them but these are my favorite top five full striped bass surf fishing lures Okay, we're at number three. My number three favorite fall 2019 surf fishing lure is the Daewa Salt Pearl Minnow. Um, great lures, they cast quite well in the wind. Um, and may, I'm gonna add, I prefer the sinking minnow. If I'm gonna pick one minnow, I'm gonna pick the sinking minnow. Um, cast great in the wind, work great at night, work great in the day. Um, Work great in a below moderate surf. Um, a great lure to have in your bag. Um, definitely don't leave home without it. But my number three for 2019 surf fishing lure I like to use is the Daewa SP Minnows. Um, I like to carry uh, a lighter color for the day and of course a darker color for the night. Um, great to work in a moderate to less surf. Um, cast great in the wind and the fish just key in on their action. They're just fantastic stuff. But this is my number three favorite full striped bass 2019 surf fishing lure. Lots of stuff out there. Everything works. Um, bass this time of year will just about hit anything you put in front of them. But these are my favorite top five full striped bass surf fishing lures. Okay, we're coming into number two now. My number two favorite full striped bass 2019 surf fishing lures, if you guys haven't guessed, is the needlefish. Now, I do like to carry two, at least two needles with me at all times, a heavy and a moderate. If I know what's going on, I may just carry one to lighten up the load. I like the heavy one for moderate to heavy surf or from moderate to heavy current. And I like the lighter needle to fish moderate to light surf or from light to still currents. Actually, still currents, I'd go lighter than this guy. But this is definitely my number two. Um, they're quite versatile lures. You can work them in an infinite array of possibilities on how you work the needlefish. Uh, the heavier needle for moderate to heavy surf, lighter needle for moderate to less surf. So I do like to carry two around to work all conditions. And you have these two lures with you, you can work in all conditions. Great sand deals or no sand deals. But coming in at number two for my full striped bass favorite surf fishing lures for 2019 is the needlefish. Lots of stuff out there, everything works. Um, bass this time of year will just about hit anything you put in front of them. But these are my favorite top five full 
striped bass, surf fishing rules. Okay, drum roll please. Um, the number one, the number one, my number one, for surf 2019 striped bass surf fishing lore. If you have not guessed, if you have not been watching, is the surf fishing season. These are by far definitely my favorite fishing lure. I will not leave home without these. I may not always use them, uh, but I will always have them in my bag. The surf fishing, the striped bass surf fishing teaser uh, will just about take any fish that swims, especially when you work them in conjunction with other lures. Um, of course, I prefer dark colors at night, light colors in the day. Number one color is for night is going to be the blurple. Or I guess you could call it blurple. Purple. That is going to be my number one night surf fishing lure. Is a purple 3-0 teaser. This will take anything. If there's fish about, they will grab it. Some nights exclusively, you're going to be picking them up on the surf the surf fishing teaser. This is my number one lure. I will work actually any year at all. Daytime, I will go to a. I like the yellows actually for the bass and a white background. And it's just tied onto a 3 0 hook. I have a video out there you can tie them yourselves. They course dimes to make. Um, get a pack of mustad hooks, get a piece of bucktail, and you can literally tie them for nickels a piece. And they will take more fish, I believe, than any other lure out there anytime. Well, most times, not all the time. Sometimes they key in um, on other things. But <laughs> my number one full striped bass surf fishing lure for 2019 or any year is the surf fishing teaser. Since we're on the teaser, I'm going to talk briefly about them. There's a whole video out there, how to time, and I have another video, how to rig them. I think I have the links are above over there by the eye. Um, but for the bass, I do like a 3 0 Mustad hook, uh, 3407, uh, I believe. And uh, it's a really full pattern, pushes a lot of water, works great with just about any lure. And I fish them maybe 90% of the time in conjunction with everything I had showed you. And some days, fish will key in on the teaser primarily. Some days they'll take it in half. Other days, you're going to be hitting them with the lure. That's just how fishing is. You just don't know. But this is definitely will not leave home without the teaser. And this is my number one full striped bass surf fishing lure for 2019 or any year at all but it is the surf fishing teaser at number one. Lots of stuff out there, everything works. Um, bass this time of year will just about hit anything you put in front of them. But these are my favorite top five full striped bass surf fishing rules. All right, I'm gonna get going now, but uh, definitely a quick rundown. I hope it was a quick rundown of my top five full 2019 favorite striped bass surf fishing lures, Little Neck Popper, the diamond jig, there was soil pearl minnow, needlefish, and of course the teasers. About probably the only five lures, actually there's a few more that uh, I like, I prefer to use. Do what you want, do what works. This is just what I do. My favorite top five surf fishing lures. I'd love to hear yours. And uh, I'm gonna get going, it's super windy out. I gotta get fishing. And uh, thanks for watching. Please like, uh, dislike, comment, subscribe to the channel or not, unsubscribe. And uh, remember always, fish your way. And have a great day, afternoon, night, day, evening, wherever you are. And thanks again.